Background music, background sounds. It kind of buckled right here when I was first applying it, but I mean, it's not that big of a deal, I don't think. So these aren't like regular stickers. They definitely have some kind of texture that lets you know they're thicker, but we can get it up close. Just make sure when you're applying it, everything's clean on the sticker end and no dirt and whatnot, you know. So I got the stickers off of Amazon from a seller called Inlay Stickers. Um, I don't really know why I wanted to do that to my guitar, but I like it, whatever. If you guys think I caused some atrocity or I ruined the guitar, well, that's your problem, because I still like it, so. <laughs> so I hope the stickers stay on. They feel okay. Um, I just worry about them peeling off, <laughs> you know. But when you buy them, they come in a pack, kind of like this, and they just want to show you A, B, C, D, you know, which one's which. And then this just shows you the layout that you can use if you want to follow their design, which for the most part I did, um, with the exception of adding some of these little end pieces wherever I wanted. But you can get really creative with this stuff, but it's real simple. It's literally just cut it out, um, plop on the sample as you've seen, and then peel it off. So it's just a decal sticker, you know. Well, I hope you enjoyed that little video. You guys take care. Bye.